Well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and today I'm at a special place again. This is called Pip My Camp Out 2. I hope you enjoy this uh, Pimp My Camp Out Part 2 at Donnie Palolini's Campground. And he's been working out here lately. Let's see the trail marks and I forgot my ranger hat, but it's okay. I still love you. And look what he's been doing, folks. He's been working out here. He has a nice little tarp up here. And he moved my bush chair. Damn you, Donnie! How dare you do it to me? <laughs> you, you bastard. <laughs> but I come out here to pimp out Donnie's campground once again. I'm gonna put, uh, I show you at the end of this video, at, this, at the end of this subject, what I'm going to, how and what I'm going to do to pimp out Donnie's campground. Just think about this, look at this before. And you'll see after or in a few seconds now. All right, so let's turn you off real quick. All right, now you just saw before and after. Uh, what I'm going to do now, even though you're not going to, you go, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're going to see before and after. Okay, what I'm going to do now is uh, work on Donnie's campground. I'm gonna do some stuff to it. Let's take a look on this side, see how everything looks before and after. Okay. All right, I got a surprise for him. It looks like he's been going back here. Oh man, look at this. He got, looks like he got his hidden spot going on back here. A hidden trail. See, that's another thing I'm doing for Donnie. I'm gonna bring some buckets back here for him and put all kinds of goodies in there for him. And this little, and this is a little private area. And look at all this firewood he has over here. And I'm gonna hide some buckets over here for him so he can make a bug out place. So when his invasion video comes, he has a place to invade. All right. That's right, he's, a, he's been tagged by me to do the invasion video. And don't worry folks, part two of my invasion video is going to be next week. The reason why, I only had one day off this week. Damn work. So I'm going to... So I'll come out here to pimp out Donnie's campground. And next week... I should have three days off, and Invasion Part 2 should be going up. So please be patient. I know y'all want to see what's in my B.O.B. bag. So uh, just give me patience. Days off is required for this, because I want to stay out there for about at least three days, or two days, try to, and summer camp. So I should stay out there, because I got water to dip myself in. It's so hot. All right, when we get to work, and I'll see you in a few minutes. Remember, before, and let me show you over here what it looks like now, and you'll see after. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this is called Pimp My Camp Out Part 2. I hope you enjoy. Well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and I want to show you some stuff that I've been doing at Donnie Polanini's camp. So I've been out here since about 12 o'clock or so, and I've been working on Donnie Pine Laney's camp house again. This is a uh, part two of Pit My Camp. Come take a look. This is what I've been doing. I didn't do much late uh, right now, but I put this up. And what this is for is to put his wood down so keep it off the ground and dry. And I'm going to put a lean-to to keep all his wood dry. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to do that. All 
All right, maybe not. I need some sticks. All right, so I'm gonna go out and find some sticks. I need uh, at least two going like that. And I'm gonna create uh, like a little lean-to and put some firewood underneath there. Well, hello there. I'm Ranger Cookie. And today I want to show you what I've done at Donnie Pallolini's campsite. This place just needs a little love here. And I have done it. A little bit more love and it'd be perfect for any camper. For doing all kinds of bushcrafting and just camping. Take a look what I did for Donnie. I got him so much firewood. We can just watch him do bushcrafting all the time. And he don't have to get no firewood. And, and I have one just like that for Donnie. There's the little bush chair right there. Uh, I'm going to surprise him at my campsite because we're going to build two bush chairs and two cot chairs. We're going to enjoy ourselves at my summer camp. And guess who else helped? Guess who else? Don't you see him? You see him? Do you see him? Hello! I'm over here! Where are you, Larry? I'm right behind you! That's right, even Larry came out to help us. And today is Donnie's birthday. Ain't that right? Oh, yes indeed! Oh, yes indeed! I helped you! Yep, Larry tried to help by moving sticks. Uh, Larry, are you gnawing on it or are you helping? I don't know! I move sticks all day! Oh, yeah! I help her! I help too! I help! I help! I help! <laughs> you gonna scare him today, huh? Yes, I am! So me and Larry is gonna get him today. Ain't that right, Larry? Stop licking me! Oh no, the salty taste! You gonna get your whiskers all wet. I don't care. Well, we're waiting for Donnie. Today is his birthday. So we're gonna celebrate his birthday today. Oh yes! Happy birthday, Donnie! <laughs> All right, look what else what I did for Donnie. Boy, every time I see a video and they got that table right there, boy, this brings joy to me because I built that table for him. I'm so happy I, I did. This place needed some love and I gave him some love. He was in so much in a rush the other day, he left his tarp out here. Yeah, he left his tarp out here. Poor Donnie. It was raining on him, wasn't it? Yes, indeed. And look, his little wawoo stick. Let's take a look at it. I want to play. I want to play. You want to play, Larry? Yes, indeed. Can't wait for Donnie to come out, huh? Oh, yeah. I'm going to get him, too. So, uh, how this thing works? Well, you got to hold it. There you go, Larry. And what am I supposed to do now? Ain't that cool? Look, Larry's holding it. What? Oh, I'll wait till you pull this thing out of your mouth. I said I love it! Okay, you love it. Alright. I can't wait for Donnie to go and get his ass here. I have one more hour. And I'm going to surprise him again for his birthday. Happy birthday, Donnie! Happy birthday, Donnie! Whee! All right. We're going to wait for him to come. And we're going to surprise him one more time. This is called Pimp My Tent Tent. Camp Out Part 2. I hope you enjoy what I have did for my friend, Donnie Pallolini. I notice it gets cool here around evening time. I'm so um, thrilled about that. Uh, I got a bush chair Tom made. I told Tom to make two of these for me. See how big it is? But it's all right, Tom, I like it. I just did a little new little loop la here. And I might give you some measurements for the next bush chair. But I wanted this one long for a couple of reasons. I fell asleep in this thing waiting for Donnie. Yes, and I you. Whoa, 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 right? And I'm gonna put Larry somewhere he's hidden, so Donnie don't see him. Where you gonna put you, at? Uh, uh, Larry? I don't know. Oh, don't you just hate when a cat just looks at you 
and licks you in your face. Oh, damn you! Damn you! <laughs> All right, we're gonna hide you, Larry. Ah, there you go. Let's put you right here. You scary. Oh, you oh, very scary. All right. <laughs> hey, that's scary. Larry scares me sometimes. His eyes just stare at you. Wherever you move, it's, he's always following you. Look, watch. Look at him, he's looking right at you. Regardless, wherever you turn your eyes, he's always gonna stare at you. Stop scaring me, Larry. <laughs> Oh yeah, I love it. All right, well, Larry's over there. We've got one more hour. It's four something. So we're gonna wait for Donnie Paulini to come see his new camp house. And I gave him two of these metal rods. I don't know what he's gonna do with it. Then I gave him one of these old screens that I use at my job that we don't use because it's been damaged and tears holes in us. So I gave him that. So he, you're gonna see some bush cooking on that thing. And now he has more time to do bushcrafting instead of collecting firewood. Yes, indeed. So, you see Larry some a cider over there, ain't you, Larry? Oh, yeah. I'm cider at her. So, we're both excited for Donnie. Today is his birthday. Happy birthday, Donnie. We're going to sing your birthday, birthday thing when he gets here. All right. We'll stay tuned for the next part. Uh, all right, now. Well, look who's coming now. Look, it's Donnie Polly Lady. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? We doing good. We doing good. What's happening? What's going down? Well, look what I've done for Mr. Donnie. This is his birthday. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. So I came out here to Donnie Paulini's to hook him up for a birthday gift. Because I want to see more bushcrafting. So go. I stocked him up with firewood. Dang. Dang it. Man. Lord. So me and, and uh, another fella wants to uh, make sure you do nothing but bushcrafting. So what you think, Mr. Donnie, for your birthday present thank you very much i am the happy birthday boy <laughs> <laughs> so wow, check it out man good lord yeah so that's how i want you to keep it like that see how yeah. you got over there yeah and put your hammock hey hold the take okay that. take your hammock and put it over here Oh, okay. Oh, good lord. Good God. <laughs> Shit. You scared the crap out of me. God, I don't mind. Larry helped Ooh, out, too. Look at this. Thank you, Larry. Thank you, Larry. You should have seen him. He's he got a little jaw in here. Yeah, Larry was helping. <laughs> he was trying to help. Man, good lord. Larry, he's quite the tongue wrestler. <laughs> ah, Damn I, you, Larry. I, I don't need a bath. You're supposed to love me. I don't... <laughs> Ooh, thanks for the bath, Larry. <laughs> thanks for the bath. Oh, yeah. I'm loving it. So how you like your Christmas? Uh, oh, sorry. Birthday present. I like it, Larry. I like it, buddy. Oh, yeah. I sure do. <laughs> how about that, man? I'm glad it's you awesome. enjoy it. Awesome, man. This yep. is cool. Me and Larry uh, came out here, and we uh, fixed him up so he does nothing but bushcrafting. You don't have to grab a lot of firewood. That's it. That's it. Oh, yeah, man. I it's, hope you enjoy it. I do. I do enjoy it. Oh, Ooh. damn, Larry. He's supposed to be... Man, that Larry, he's a, he's a, he's a, he's a <laughs> hell of a, a friendly feller. Yes, I are you. <laughs> so, Larry, uh, this is his birthday today, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> so, um, I got something for you. All oh, right. The... Cool, 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 cool. It's over here. You know... I'm not going to use this big monster. Oh, man. Take it as a gift. Man. Happy birthday. Thank you, sir. My Happy goodness birthday. gracious. Goodness <laughs> gracious. Golly. God. Thank you, Larry. You're welcome. Thank you, Ranger Cookie. Good You're Lord. Welcome. Have mercy. 
Man. I I came out here. I thought about Check using it out. or how yeah. to use it, but uh, man, yeah, yeah, my gosh, which model is this? That's the that's the Shrade. Man, uh, I have no use for this big monster. No man. use, no use. And yeah, but this man right here. We use the hell out of it. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Damn, Larry, stop! Larry, no, Larry, no, Larry. no, no! <laughs> Damn, Larry, you're getting Lord. so excited. It's your first time meeting Donnie, isn't it? Yep. Yes, it is. Yeah, yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's an SCHF nine. Wow. All right, yeah. Larry. Gotta say goodbye. Say bye bye. Bye, Larry. Aww. Bye, Larry. He, he enjoy your you company. You little rascal, you. All right, Good Bubba, you ready? Gosh. Man, isn't that a sweet blade, though, man? Isn't that sweet? Good Lord. Man, I like that. Sure do. I didn't know what to think about these, these blades with the hooks in them, but since I watched a couple of guys sharpen them up, because they look tough to sharpen to me, you know? Uh, I've never I've never tried to sharpen a curved blade like that. Have you? No, but Tom knows how to do that. He, I saw his video. He uh, yeah. whatever you know. Blah, 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 yeah, blah, blah. man, I like that. It feels good. Feel the weight's comparable to the SCHF 37, which is pretty freaking sweet, man. It's awesome. I gotta try this sucker out, man. I got to, I got to do something. With it. Come on, show me something. Hey, look, look. I, I was going to cut this, but I got. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah, yeah I can batan it or whatever. Yeah. What happened to my hammer I made for you? You burnt it, didn't you? Why no, you did it, no, Donnie? No, Miss Kelly burnt that after being repeatedly told that is my baton. So, Miss Kelly, thank you, Miss Kelly. Damn you, winch. That's right. Oh man, yeah. Man, that's that was just easy. Easy beat, pre beat, what is it? Easy peasy, one, two, three, easy. Heck yeah, man. Good lord. Man, that's just nothing to it. Let's try this little hard piece of oak here. That's a little bit tougher, but man, yeah. Good lord, that's nice. You see how it cuts with uh, uh what you want to cut? I'm gonna try uh, a stick. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna try a little stick here. Got a handle on it. That's doing good. That's pretty tough stick there. All right. Let's see. I guess I need to support it on something. Oh, of it's course. Gone. It's some reason I just don't like a big knife. I, I always enjoy the little knives. I have. I came out here to use it and. I see that she got his like feather stick real close to the handle. Real close to the handle. I kind of suspected that with this uh, curved blade. Man. There we go. See, I had a knot. That knot had me kind of tied up there. That ain't bad, man. Some nice looking little curls. That'll catch. All going right, man. I like it. But I tell you what else I really like is the, this the way this goes. It, it chops pretty good, you know. It really does. It chops pretty doggone good. And this is dry stick. It's not. And this little part down here, this little rounded part, is good to move your hand back. Well, it broke it. But still, it broke it because it's got a lot of force on it. Yeah, that, it's that, that weight, that at, weight the on it's at the end. Yeah. You know, I watched him. Like I like I, like I watched it. videos. Uh, his name was not nothing, not not too much fancy or not fancy or something like yeah, that. Nothing fancy. Yeah. And he, he uses a big knife, and that's all he brought. He didn't bring a machete. He walked way out there into the wilderness, and he had a big knife like this. Yeah. And. Every time I go in the woods, I never did. You like a machete. I like a machete. And I, I get that too, because I've been thinking more along the lines, of, especially like what you're doing when you're walking through trails with a lot of 
green lush yeah. foliage and stuff like that it's in your face it's in your face yeah so i totally I, get that I, I tried to use that knife to go through your trail cutting it and it was so hard and yeah i'm, I'm swinging i'm like what yeah. is the use for me to have this knife i yeah. never i have tons of big knives and i don't even use them you've seen the box it's called my box opening what knife would you pick but i did pick i did fall uh, i did hold that for a second you got it i did uh choose my pathfinder it's a sweet tom i like the pathfinder now that's a knife there guys now i can take a small knife and do that's almost the nice same knife. thing that big one can do because this one's made for it because this is the pathfinder and that's it man yes sir dave canterbury likes it and we all like dave canterbury don't we and i got my cane knife huh hey why don't you put your yeah, drink down put before you down. spill all your precious really there we go that's a knife Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, two, two whacks, I could take this tree out. But no this doubt. is in Donnie's uh, camping spot. That's I it. I, I like see to... you got your multi-tool yep. in here, don't you? I got my little setup. I got my small knife. Yeah. I got my machete, my pathfinder, and a multi-tool with a striker. And I'm good. That's all I need. That's awesome, man. I try to use I that. I, try, I got three or four big knives, and I didn't like them. I like what you did with this, putting the uh, the safety pins on the back, because those things are handy as a shirt pocket out, out here. And what happens if you're working and you get a splinter? Guess yeah. what? I could pull that out, or hey, there's that pin right here. That's right. That's right. I so saw that on your video. A little hack. A little minor. If you go in the woods and you're doing a lot of work with wood, and you get that splinter, look, there's a pin right there. And look, that? and behind here, I got okay. three more. Yes, sir. So, Donnie, how you like your birthday present? I likes it a lot. I sure do. I surely do. Nice and relaxing. Makes this little place a little bit more like the home. You know, it's nice. It's really nice. Like firewood. About the ground. Yep, me and Larry did that because we want to watch you do more bushcrafting and, and less getting firewood. Yeah, you can, me too. <laughs> Man, I like that knife. That pathfinder knife feels feels pretty good, man. That is a nice size knife. That's um, I can do, do almost anything with that knife. Yeah. I can do with this one. It's smaller, compact. It's heavy. Yeah. And I found some 550 cord out here, yep. so I borrowed that. There you go. There you go. That's what it's for. Shoot. Heck yeah, man. Absolutely. I like that's a nice rig. That's my little system I always carry now. What's that fire steel in there? That's the fire steel for the firefighter. Oh, I didn't know it had one. Yeah, it's like a little, uh, it's in, it's... Oh, okay, cool. That's, that's, you know, this is the first time I've ever really seen a Kydex sheath huh. in, in the flesh. I've never seen one. <laughs> it shows what I know, huh? But I like yeah, it. Yeah, uh, Josh has tons of lighter kayak stuff and, uh, damn you, boy! Yes, he does. Yes, he does. That's a nice rig, man. Thank you. No um, doubt about Tom it. made that, so you even touching what Tom made the, uh, the sheath. I know. Tom. And he said, I, I thought he put that on there, so use it like a like a shield, huh? <laughs> like but so he, Tom gets, no, you jackasses for putting the knives on the boy. Oh, well, right now. <laughs> That's a nice material too. I can put water in this thing. It's so really. It's like watertight. Huh? Yeah, it's like watertight. He put the seals on there pretty tight. It might Man. leak, but still, I could take water oh, for a few it. feet before yeah. it goes out. Heck yeah. Man, that is sweet, man. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Let's take a look. Very cool. I want to see if I can get Donnie to leave his bush chair just like this and put his hammock over here. But that's on him. I well, can't but force him. The thing is, sometimes I have people like uh, Kelly came out with me and I bought her a hammock. And so, I gotta have two hanging spots. Oh. That's, that's the deal. Oh. But for me, I, she's here few and far between. And as we both know, it's easy to set the chair up. So that's no big deal. And I've been actually, I've had um, Drew Roberts yeah. has camped here, and I've had Kelly camp here. I've actually never used this spot. So I'll, I'll give it a shot. Yeah, see over here, my, camp, my camping area, I have my bush chair and with my fire, with two bush chairs, and the fire and our hammocks is away from our fire because if you catch yourself on fire when you're in a hammock yeah 
You're not getting out fast. You're you going to cut yourself up. You're going to flip, right. and you're going to burn. That's exactly right. All right, man. Exactly right. I hope you enjoy my birthday gift to Donnie Happy Polanyi. Happy birthday to, to you. Me. Oh, yeah. Hang on, hang on. Somebody wants to say something to you. Yeah, I thought Larry was going to say happy yeah. birthday. Where is Larry at, damn uh, cat? Yeah, he's probably taking a leak somewhere. They got a, not, a lot of nice leaking trees around here. Here are you. Oh, there he is. <laughs> well, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you, Larry. Happy Thank birthday you, Larry. to you, Larry. <laughs> happy birthday this boy ain't right. to Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> there you go. Knock him down. Damn, Larry. That Larry's tough, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. God, God damn it. Stop. <laughs> Damn cat, always licking your face. Don't you hate when animals do that? Yeah. Oh yeah, look at him. He's a wild beast. He is oh, wild. Oh yeah, he come and get you. Who, who's next cat. on our list? How about bear? Bear. The bear, the bear guy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. i like to see you one day, bear. <laughs> bear meets, I'm sorry, Larry meets bear. Oh yeah, Rambo. That'd be a good one. All right, Donnie, and uh, this is just this man. This Thank is you, Donnie with Donnie Pavolini Outdoors, and I want to say again to Ranger Cookie, thank you, my friend, for everything you did for me today on this special day of mine, my birthday. I appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't forget Larry helped too. And, yes, I oh, yeah. And Larry, thank you, sir. <laughs> Man, he gets wound up. <laughs> you should have seen when I first scared him. He just jumped like 50 feet. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Lying. Scared the hell out of him. I can be jumpy. I'm going to lie to you. I can be... God, Larry. Stop, Larry. 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 Yeah. All to, right. need to choke back on the Viagra, boy. <laughs> All right. I'm waiting this video before it gets too long. All right. right. Before it turns into a porno. <laughs> With Larry. Kitty porn. Kitty porn. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Larry. <laughs> All right, bye-bye. I'll see you in love. <laughs>